Today we will discuss skin signs of heart diseases. It will help you to identify a few early signs and you can avoid future heart related complications by taking necessary precautions. So let's start. Heart disease can cause excess fluid buildup in the legs and feet, which causes them to swell. Swelling due to fluid buildup is called edema. Rapid lower extremity swelling with no visible or known injury could be a sign of a serious condition like a blood clot or abnormal heart function. Next important sign is blue or purple color on your skin. When you are extremely cold, your skin can turn blue or purple and it is normal. But if an area of your skin is blue or purple when you are warm, that can be a sign that your blood isn't getting enough oxygen. In medical term, we call it cyanosis. The patient in this photo has a condition known as blue toe syndrome, which happens when one or more blood vessels are blocked. You should seek medical attention as soon as possible. Without treatment, the lack of oxygen can cause the skin and underlying tissue to eventually die. Next important skin sign is Levado reticularis. Some people may have a blue or purple net-like pattern on the skin when they feel cold. When their skin warms up, this pattern disappears. It's also possible to see this pattern when taking certain medications like minocycline, gemcitabine, and heparin. If one of these is causing this net-like pattern, it's usually nothing to worry about. This net-like pattern can also be a sign of a disease called cholesterol embolization syndrome, which occurs when small arteries become blocked. If you notice this type of skin changes, consult a doctor to find out whether you have an undiagnosed disease. If you see yellowish orange growths on your skin, you may have deposits of cholesterol under your skin. These painless deposits can appear in many areas, including the corners of your eyes, lines of your palms, or backs of your lower legs. If you notice this growth on any area of your skin, kindly consult a doctor. Next important sign is the sudden appearance of waxy bumps on your skin. It can look like a rash, words, or a contagious skin condition called molluscum contagiosum. Here in this image you can see molluscum contagiosum infection. These bumps are actually fatty deposits of cholesterol caused by extremely high levels of triglycerides, which is a type of cholesterol in your blood. Treatment is essential to lower the triglycerides as it will help you to prevent any serious complications. Finger clubbing is another important sign of heart disease. Nail clubbing occurs when the tips of your fingers enlarge and the nails curve around the fingertips. It can be associated with many other conditions like liver disease, lung disease and inflammatory bowel disease. Red or purple dots of bloods under the fingernails are usually caused by a fingernail injury or abrasion. But if they appear without a known injury, they may be sign of heart disease or a heart infection called infective endocarditis. When fingernail streaks are a symptom of heart condition, they are usually accompanied by other symptoms like fever, weak heartbeat or irregular heartbeat. If you have a heart infection known as infective endocarditis, several painful lumps can develop in your fingers and toes. They can last for a few hours to several days. In medical terms, these lumps are called Oslar nodes. The lumps go away on their own, but the patient needs treatment for the infection. Next thing is reddish or brownish discoloration. You may find red or brown spots on your palms and soles. This is also seen in infective endocarditis or heart infection. These spots will clear without treatment, usually in a few days or weeks. But treatment is needed for the infection, so keep this in mind. Next thing you may find is smooth waxy lumps on your skin. They are called nodules of systemic amyloidosis. They often indicate that 
there is an abnormal build up of a protein in an organ such as your heart if protein builds up in your heart it's hard for the heart to work properly so to conclude this few of the above mentioned skin signs are typical appearance of heart diseases however few skin lesions can be associated with other diseases also so talk to your doctor for the evaluation so that's all for today hope you find this video helpful don't forget to like comment and share and don't forget to subscribe thank you